If you are a content creator or anyone who uses lavalier microphone, you might be interested in this one. This is the Mono WM620 lavalier wireless microphone. This is more than just a lavalier microphone like a regular one. This kind of microphone that has four level gain control, which you can select from. It has noise canceling feature. It has audio level indicator and you are able to monitor your voice as you speak if you want. Without further ado, let me walk you through its features. And there it is again. This is the Mono WM620 wireless lavalier microphone. By the time I am recording this video, this is currently 55 US dollars from the Mono.com. This is what you will see in the package. Of course, it has this manual. It comes with a magnet. So this is the magnet. And this is a USB-C to A for uh, charging. And this is the charging case with transmitters and receiver inside. So this is pretty much the battery indicator if you are charging it to charge is just over here at the back. Okay, and now if we're going to open it, ta-da, there it is. So it has two transmitters. So these are the transmitters and this is the receiver. And now let's do a test. Let's connect this uh, receiver to this device for reference. This is Samsung S24 Ultra. Okay, I'm now connecting this one to here. Okay, and now I'm going to turn on this uh, transmitter. So to turn on is just uh, over here, the power button right there. So just press and hold. Okay, and this one also, press and hold, power button on here. Okay, there it is. It shows the TX right there blinking. That means they're not yet connected to here. Also here, you can see they're both uh, blinking. TX1 and 2 are both uh, blinking, so that means they're not yet connected. To connect them is uh, pretty simple. What you will do is uh, press uh, three times this uh, noise canceling button on here. So three times, one, two, three, and it will blink fast like that. And you also have to press three times the noise canceling on here. This one here, one, two, three. Okay, and wait until it's paired. There you go. So as you notice, it stopped blinking for both of them. So this one stopped blinking and also over here. So that means they are now connected. Now, let's say I wanted to use only one microphone. So I'm going to put this back and as soon as I put it back, it automatically turns off and it tells you here the level of uh, your battery on this case. So again, this case also charges your battery. By using this uh, microphones alone, it takes about six hours. And uh, by using this uh, charging case, it, uh, you will have up to uh, 18 hours uh, usage of this uh, microphone on here. And as you can see, it is currently charging because I use it up a bit already. So that's how it extends your uh, battery of using this kind of a microphone. In my opinion, actually, the price is really great because you get two microphones. And in fact, if you, let's say, you don't have that one anymore and only this one, it still works because this one here, you can charge by itself. So from there, you can use this one. You can charge it from there. Please take note, when you do charge, make sure to use only the five volt uh, cable. Otherwise, it could damage your microphone. So you have to watch out for that. And now looking at this, uh, receiver on here. So you will have this uh, port over here. That is if you want to uh, monitor your audio. So that means if I'm going to be connecting an earphone, something like this, I can just connect it to here and then I can monitor my voice if I want. And on the other side, this is a good feature also that I like about this is you can charge your device while using this uh, microphone. So it doesn't mean that uh, it occupies your your port over there that you can no longer charge your, your, your phone. So again, in this kind of receiver, there is a port right there, USB-C, for you to be able to charge while you're doing your maybe streaming or recording. And over here, you have this button on here. This is your mute button. So please take note, you have a mute button on here as well on this uh, transmitter. So the mute button is just over here. So 
that's the one over there and you have also mute button on here now to use the mute button on here what i'll do is i'm just going to simply press and hold it and you will notice this one turns red so that means you're muted now to unmute same thing just press and hold and there you go it's turns to solid white again. Now, if you want to turn on mute on here, you simply tap once, not hold. Okay, so tap and there it is. So it turns red, so that means you are muted. And it, sho it shows you here as well. If you're muted, this one also changes here. So it turns red also over here. Okay, I'm going to unmute now. There it is. And this uh, battery indicator right there, um, Unfortunately, it doesn't give us the, the bars, like three bars, uh, two bars, or full bar. It doesn't do like that. Now, your only battery indicator here is if this battery is red and it's flashing, that means your battery level is less than 5%. This next uh, icon right there, that is your noise uh, level cancellations. You have two. You have indoor cancellations for the first one, and then the second one is the outdoor cancellation. And to uh, control that, same thing, you can control it from here, from this transmitter, or from this receiver. Let's say we want to control the noise uh, canceling over here, and it's just going to be on top here. So there you go, on top there. So simply uh, press it once. So this is noise cancellation being turned off. So no more uh, lights over there for the second one. And now if I'm going to turn it one time, press one time. So that is your first level cancellation, which is the indoor uh, level cancellation. If you press it again, and that should be your outdoor noise uh, cancellation. If you want to press it again, it turns off the noise uh, cancellation. The same here, if you're going to control or change or turn on or off the noise cancellation, you just have to tap this uh, button right there, tap it once, and that should be your indoor noise cancellation or level one, and then tap it again one more, and that should be your uh, outdoor noise uh, cancellation, and then tap it again, and it will turn off the noise uh, cancellation. And this one here, this is your four level gain that you can select from when you are doing your recording. And over here, let me show you some more features on here. So of course, this is to turn on, as I showed you, this is your noise uh, cancellation button. Uh, this one here, this is to mute, unmute button. And this one here, this is if you want to add a reverb to your voice. So this is the feature for that. And now let's do a test recording from this Samsung device. For me to monitor my uh, vocals or audio, I want to use this earphone. So I'm going to connect it to here. Okay. Okay. And from here, I'm going to, I'm going to tap now record. Okay, you should see that recording audio through USB mic. If you don't see that, that means uh, this microphone is not connected to your device. Maybe it's loose over here. So you have to properly plug in uh, that uh, receiver to your device. Okay, and from here, whatever you're listening, this is now the recorded audio from this uh, Samsung device on here. And right now, I am currently at uh, gain level number one okay and maybe i'm going to show you first uh, using the uh, the uh, noise level cancellation on here okay if i'm going to top it tap once okay so right now i had turned off the noise reduction and this is going to be your audio output i'm just gonna keep quiet for a bit okay so again this is your uh, noise reduction being turned off i'm going to tap tap it once Okay, so this is your indoor noise reduction or level one noise uh, level reduction. I'll tap it again one time. Okay, so this is your outdoor level cancellation or level two uh, noise uh, cancellation. Now, if I'm going to press and hold this one, as I mentioned earlier, you will be muted if you do that. So I'm going to tap and hold or press and hold. There you go. So I just uh, uh, unmuted myself. Okay, and uh, now I'm going to be changing the gain level from here so you're able to tell or to check what it's going to be. Okay, right now I am going to uh, change it to the next level, the level two. 
Okay, so this is now gain level two. Soundtrack testing one, two, one, two, three, four, and this is your audio output. I'm going to be changing this one now to gain level three. Okay, there you go. So this is now at gain level three. Soundtrack testing one, two, one, two, three, four. I'm going to be changing this one now to the last one, gain level four. Okay, soundtrack testing one, two, one, two, three, four. It is actually pretty, pretty loud. And as you notice, this microphone is over here. I'm just going to be uh, setting it back to maybe at least number three. Okay, there you go. And now I'm going to maybe use this other one here. Okay, uh, because I turned this on al already earlier, normally as you pick it up, it automatically uh, turns on. However, if it doesn't, what you do is simply uh, turn it on with this power button right there. So right now, as you can see, it is not uh, blinking. So that means this is now connected to here. Uh, I'm actually very loud. I'm going to decrease my gain. Okay, there you go. So I just uh, changed my gain level to number two as I'm using two microphones this time. Okay, and as you hold this one, you have to be very careful because this pick up noises so easily. See, like that. Okay, let me show you over here. As I mentioned earlier, this port right there, you are able to charge this by themselves with uh, this uh, cable. So connect USB-C to there and then USB-A to a power block, maybe the ones that you can use to charge your devices or maybe phone. If I am going to maybe use the noise level cancellation on here, so I'm going to tap this one right there. I'm going to tap it once. Okay, I just turn off the noise reduction. I'm going to tap it again. Okay, so this is indoor noise reduction. I'm going to tap it again. Okay, so this is outdoor noise reduction or level two noise reduction. And this button over here, this is the button that would give your voice reverb, maybe for singing purposes or any other purposes that requires a reverb to your voice. This is actually a feature that is not very common to a regular level ear like this one on here. Let's turn it on to check. Okay, so this is a singing mode, soundtrack testing one, two, one, two, three, four. So again, you can maybe use this one most likely for recording song or anything that requires reverb to your voice. Maybe you can actually record, maybe you're playing a guitar and singing along with that. This is actually a good feature in where you do not need another application or another device to give your voice uh, reverb. Okay, I'm going to turn it off now. On this one here, this is to mute yourself. So on here, you just have to tap once and you will mute yourself. And like here, you have to press and hold to mute yourself. Okay, I'm going to turn on mute on here I'll, or I'll mute myself. Okay, there you go. I muted myself on here. I'm going to tap it once again to unmute myself. Okay, I unmuted myself. There you go. And oh, this uh, one over here, this is the port that you are able to connect um, another lavalier microphone. So which means you can turn a wired lavalier microphone into wireless like this one here. So again, this is a wired lavalier microphone. So very self-explanatory, connect this one to here and you should be able to use this lavalier microphone or turning this into a wireless uh, microphone. But please uh, take note, if you're going to use this lavalier or connect this uh, lavalier to here, this one also works. So that means this uh, Mono 620 uh, lavalier microphone also pick up noises. So maybe if you will be doing this one, if you do not want to use this one, make sure you place this one somewhere that uh, you will not be touching it. Otherwise, it will pick up noises. Okay, let me uh, show you. I'm going to turn, I'm going to connect this one now to here. Okay, I'm just going to place this one over here. Okay, I'm going to talk on this uh, lavalier microphone. Maybe I'm going to move this away from here. Okay, I'll place this one also over there. Okay, sound check. Testing one, two, one, two, three, four. And this time, I am using this lavalier microphone. And as I mentioned earlier, this other end also pick up noises. I'm going to tap it right now.
and I can even talk from here also. Okay, sound check testing one, two, one, two, three, four, sound check. And I'm going to use this one again, sound check testing one, two. Technically, there could be four of you talking to each other using this two uh, transmitters from this uh, set of uh, microphone. Soundtrack testing one, two, one, two, three, four. There you go. So again, in my opinion, this is a feature that is not very common to a regular lavalier. With this uh, price range, uh, I would say this is really a good uh, price. Now, if you are curious if uh, the singing uh, voice or singing uh, feature here will work, okay, let's uh, turn it on. Okay, so this is now in a singing mode. There you go, soundtrack testing one, two. One, two, three, four. As you notice, it does work as well on here. I'm going to turn it off now. Okay, so now it's back to original voice without any reverberation. Okay, and now let me show you how to use this magnet over here and how strong it is. If I'm going to use this one here, I'll show you how strong it is. There you go. And it can even pick up both of them. There you go. Let's say I wanted to place this one underneath this uh, jacket. Then I'm just going to put it under and then I'm going to put this one on top. And there you go. So uh, that is uh, pretty uh, neat uh, to have this magnet. You can put it anywhere you want as long as it's not super thick that it holds the, the magnet into this uh, microphone on there. And there you go. I hope this gives you now an idea as to the features of this kind of microphone, the Maono WM620 level, your wireless microphone. By the way, I want to thank to Maono for sending me this microphone for me to be able to test it out. And if you want uh, to uh, get uh, this kind of microphone, feel free to uh, check their website, demiano.com. I will be adding also a link under the description together with the discount uh, code. Thank you guys for watching. If you like this type of video, please give it a like. And if you want more of this type of videos, consider subscribing if you haven't done yet. And hit the notification bell. Keep safe and until next time.